Local man wants to start a mental health group to talk about the impact of crime and police violence on black men. The group will have its first meeting this week, and as News Channel 5's Kyle Haran learned, the man behind this effort says the issue is rarely talked about in black communities. Um, we'll probably have a fear of our guests and what have you, they'll be up there. Ron Johnson is imagining what it will look like when his meeting of minds comes together. He wants to have about 25 people here to talk about violence and things that need changing. When the kids experience it, or young adults or what have you, we say, you need to get over that, so to speak. Johnson says mental health is not an issue black men like to talk about. Growing up, it's often treated as a part of life, something not to be discussed. Well, the climate that we're living in, in in this country right now is it's uh, it's toxic. Uh, you know, we see unarmed black men uh, being murdered uh, by the police. But he knows what's happening across all 50 states does have an impact. He says he realized the need for a group after a friend of his called him upset. I'm thinking, wow, is, has something happened to his kids or in his family? And no, it was what he was seeing and experiencing, uh, seeing the things that's happening to, to us as black men in this country. And he said, I can't take no more, man. I don't know what to do. And that is where uh, he and I kind of put our minds and heads together and said, that's mental health, man. That's trauma. Johnson is calling this group that will meet at venue 109 in Madison, experiencing mental health. I need men to come in and say, you know what? The fight that I've been having for such a long time, the enemy is the inner me. That is where I've been wrestling with more things than I can ever imagine. And I have not found a space to be able to share it in a greater way. He hopes what he's doing now will become a movement for positive change. Kyle Haram, News Channel 5. The group is meeting for the first time this Sunday at 630 in the evening.